We just finished up the number nine shootout here in Clovis, New Mexico, the Curry County Special Event Center. It's the Southwest Regional Finals. What a deal. They came out of the fourth callback to win the roping. Chad Smith now. His partner is none other than the team of Eric Strick. Eric Strick on the backside, the 39 and 18, their fourth high back. Chad Smith, Eric Strick, 39-18 at 10-16 to lead it. And they're gonna be smooth here by the 9-53, and we got new leaders at 48 and 71. Ladies and gentlemen, the win of the Ropen. It is going to be Chad Smith and Eric Strick. How about you, man? $10,000 to the richer. They got brand new Martin Trophy saddles. Well, folks, I tell you what, it was an exciting finish right here in the number nine shootout for the Southwest Regional Finals. It was Chad Smith and Eric Strick. They were the fourth high team back. Chad on the head side, they're both out of Oklahoma. He gets out on this steer, gets him roped, and then in for the heel shot, it's Eric, and he ropes that dude by two feet. They're nine and 53. They take over the lead and the win with a 48 and 71. They take home $10,000 and brand new Martin Trophy saddles. I had just a moment to catch up with Chad and talk to him. He was excited about his win, pretty happy to have a brand new saddle and his part of $10,000. Chad's a champion header right here. Chad, congratulations, first of all. You. Uh, you just you just won 10000 bucks in a brand new saddle, and I understand you've been roping all weekend long, and it's been a struggle to get here. Tell me about that. Yes, sir. I, I tell you, team roping's an amazing sport. Uh, it's very forgiving. I had a really rough weekend. I've been here since Friday, roped in a lot of ropings and just couldn't get anything done. Struggling with the barrier. And you just got to keep going at it, not give up. Cause sooner or later, if you keep in there and keep working at it, it'll come around. Yes, sir. So you guys were like fourth high team back in this short round right here. Uh, tell me what you're thinking as you back into the box. Well, the main thing I was going through my head, like I said, I've been struggling with that bear, and I wanted to make sure that even if I was a little late, I knew Eric could make up the time for me. He's a good run and a good partner, so I just knew if I just hold in there and, and get, a good, get a good start but take my time and make a good corner for him, he'd rope him clean, and he did. You bet. So, uh, so you, guys, uh, you guys came in there. Walk me through exactly what happened the run. Uh, you got out from behind the barrier to, to the rest till you faced up. We drawed a really good steer. He, you know, he was really good on a steer. He uh, slowed up just a little when I got there, uh, but he was real honest. And he was really honest on the corner. He set the corner really good, and the first hop was really solid. And I think Eric roped him on a second or third hop. He did a great job roping him. He was in good position. You bet. So you guys, uh, you guys, or you came from Cheyenne, Oklahoma, all the way over here to Clovis. What brings you to a roping like this here? Well, we always try to come down to the regional finals. You know, it's a great place to come. There's a lot of added money that you guys put in in the ropings, and uh, there's always good turnout. It's a really nice. You can't beat the facility. It's a great place to come. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, congratulations. And, uh, man, glad you finally got to take some, back some of that money, 10000 You're part of 10000 and a brand-new saddle. Yes, sir. Thank you, Ben. Well, as you can see, Chad's had quite the weekend bringing him here to the uh, Southwest Regional Finals. He's been roping quite a bit, quite a lot, but perseverance pays off, and he gets it. His part of $10,000 in a brand-new saddle. Also, his partner, Eric, lucky to even be riding a horse, he gets his part of $10,000 and a brand-new saddle. It was interesting to visit with him as well. Eric, I understand uh, that, that you've had a few hardships even getting right here to Clovis. Tell me about that. Last September, I, uh, September 1st, I broke my hip, horse fell with me, and uh, 17 days later, my little girl was born, so uh, we've had a lot of time in the house, and I'm just pretty fortunate to be able to be riding horses and roping, and, and very thankful that I was able to do good today. So a few life-changing situations, and then again, right here, you guys are uh, the champions out of this number nine shootout. What does that mean to you? Well, that's my first saddle I've won, and, and it's... That's kind of neat. I guess it'll sink in later. So it's, it's, it's pretty, pretty neat. So what brought you down here to the Southwest Regional Finals? Everybody told me how good the regional finals were, and I've never been to one. And I just I wanted my wife and kids to come, but they had stuff going on at the house. So I just thought I'd come down here by myself and Chad, and we've been friends for a long time. And we just teamed up here and decided. Heck, 
Heck yeah, so now you get to call her and tell her, hey, honey, I'm bringing home about 5000 a brand-new saddle. What's she going to say to that? I don't know if I'll tell her until I get home. <laughs> <laughs> there you I go. i got two kids that will climb all over that saddle, so it'll work out. Man, that's what it's all about. How about the U.S. Finals? You, you've been there? You going to go there? I missed it last year because I broke my hip, and so I – yeah, I'll go there. I'm trying to get my wife to get, get a shoot out there, and maybe we can go rope together. It's kind of, I was kind of felt bad for those that husband and wife team earlier because they were high call back until we beat them, and I, because that's the toughest one to rope for is your wife. It is, it is. Eric, I tell you what, great roping today. Congratulations, and uh, we're gonna wish you the best at Oklahoma City. Eric Strick broke his hip, and man, he's he's riding good. He's got a brand new uh, brand new kid. Man, that ten thousand is going to come in handy. Also, the brand new saddle. They'll get their use out of that as well. It was great roping right here, and we're going to recap the top five finishers. In the fifth place, it was Rex Allen Hawkins and his partner Fred Lucero, New Mexico and Texas team. They came to the short round in the seventh callback. They made a run right here of 15 and 41, and that gives them a total of 55 and 31. They finished in fifth place. Fourth place was a team out of El Paso, Texas. It was Renee Moya and Joel Hernandez. These guys were 39-82 to qualify to the short round. They made a run of 15-47. That gave them a 55-29, and they took home $1,828. In third place, it was the husband-wife team of Tammy and Johnny Guest. They come out of Colorado City, Texas. They were a 43-08. Tammy gets out on this steer, ropes him, and then Johnny moves in, and it is nothing but net. This guy catches two feet. They're 10 and 41 on the run. 53 and 49 gives them third and $3,658. Then second place, it's Heidi Payne out of Rio Dosa. Her partner's Connor Hall out of Capitan, New Mexico. They were the fifth callback. With a 39-59, they made a smooth run right here of 976. Heidi's on a great horse, gets it on that steer. Her partner ropes two feet. Connor does a great job. They're 49-35 and take home $5,486 for their efforts. And we'll take another look at the high team back. It's Chad Smith out of Cheyenne, Oklahoma. His partner Eric Strick on the backside, also from Oklahoma. Chad gets a good start on this steer, and then he ropes him, does a great job handling him. And Eric, man, 9 and 53 right here. They're 48 and 71. They get $10,000 in brand new Martin Trophy saddles. What a deal. Well, that's it. It's an exciting finish right here. We've got one more coming at you. It's the number eight pig draw from right here at the Curry County Special Event Center in Clovis, New Mexico. It's the Southwest Regional Finals. Thanks for tuning in to the final spin.